Once upon a time, there were three lemons. A pink lemon, a Maya lemon, and uh, just a regular lemon, I guess. They lived a peaceful life in a cottage by the river. We, we are, are content. content. One day, a man came to the cottage with a bottle of bourbon. Would you like to get in on the ground floor of an exciting new opportunity? Said the man. Well, well yes, well, yes, 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 yes. Said the lemons. It's a turnkey solution for dynamic synergies. But the man was a liar. He cut the lemons in half and squeezed out all of the juice. story is, don't trust strange men who offer you bourbon. We're gonna take our three lemons and we're gonna make three different whiskey sours and, uh, you know, have a taste test for science. I'm just gonna do a quick taste test of the juice. You gotta, you gotta test your juice. This is just a regular lemon. Very tart. That's not a surprise. This is a Meyer lemon. Got like um, yeah, kind of a perfumey smell. Slightly less tart, maybe a little bit sweeter, and um, yeah, kind of a kind of a perfumey aroma and flavor. It's not overpowering or anything, but it's just less lemony. Now, this is uh, the pink lemon. I uh, don't really know what a pink lemon is, having done no research. The variegated pink lemons also called the variegated Eureka Lemon, or pink-fleshed Eureka Lemon, is a cultivar of lemon with unique pink flesh, a green striped rind when ripening, and a variegated foliage. It was discovered as a sport, which is a technical botanical term, on an ordinary Eureka Lemon tree in Burbank, California in 1931. Fascinating. So it sounds like it's just a random mutation of a lemon. Wikipedia article. Wikipedia has very little information. So it isn't some intentional hybrid with a grapefruit, but it does have a bitter aftertaste, not bitter, but a more bitter aftertaste. And it is definitely less acidic and tart than a regular lemon. Hmm. So in terms of whiskey sours, we'll find out. Uh, the regular lemon might be best because it'll be tart enough, whereas these other two might be too sweet. Um, but let's just try and find out. Just to make this, to give these drinks a fighting chance, I went ahead and did an ounce of juice and half an ounce of sugar in each of these. And in the regular one, I kept it to three quarters lemon, three quarters sugar, because these are just obviously less tart and it just seemed like they would be way too sweet if we did it the regular way. So we'll get more of the fruit flavor and less sugar in these, and this will be the standard recipe. All right, for science. Okay, whiskey sour number one. Mm -hmm. This tastes exactly like whiskey sour should taste. It's very familiar. Sweet and tart. Got a nice bourbon flavor coming through. Now let's try Meyer lemon. The Meyer lemon is a hybrid citrus fruit native to China. It is cross, a cross between a citron and a mandarin pomelo hybrid, distinct from the common or bitter lemon. 
The Meyer lemon is commonly grown in China in garden pots as an ornamental tree. It became popular as a food item in the United States after being rediscovered by chefs such as Alice Waters at Chez Panisse during the rise of California cuisine starting in the 1970s. Popularity further climbed when Martha Stewart began featuring them in some of her recipes. Thanks, Martha. Interesting. It's definitely a different flavor. You still get the bourbon, but it's, uh, God, it is a little sweeter. The tartness just doesn't cut through the same way. In spite of having less sugar, it's still sweeter. But it's it blends really nicely. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, really. I mean, that looks incredible. It's got a kind of bitterness to it. Uh, it does taste a bit like a grapefruit. Like, what I want is to have some sort of revelation where we're like, oh my god, pink lemons are the, the most amazing thing, but so far I'm not, I'm not feeling like pink lemon is the way to go. Pink lemon doesn't have the tartness at the beginning. At the beginning it's, it's just weak, and then it has sort of a bitter aftertaste. I'm gonna say pink lemon is not my favorite, um, and not the way to go. Obviously, a regular lemon will always be good, but a Meyer lemon is actually a, kind of a nice change of pace. Meyer lemons are pretty easy to find at the store, I would think, for most people. Pink lemons, I've, I only see occasionally, and so I'm not gonna seek those out. Meyer lemon's nice, it's got like a, a perfumey essence to it that is lending something different to the drink. Now, I will say, you could get pink lemons, and if you tweaked the recipe or added some other element to keep your interest at the beginning, that would be a fine thing to make a drink out of. Just, But whiskey sours may not be the way to go uh, for pink lemons. Alright, I guess that's it. My conclusions, whiskey sours are great. Uh, Meyer lemon whiskey sours, it's pretty interesting, not bad. Pink lemon whiskey sours, eh, not so much. Thanks for watching, uh, like and subscribe, and uh, we'll see you next time. Lemons. Science. Wikipedia. Martha Stewart. <laughs>